Hey, good morning. What's going on, people? Whatever else. It's me, Lindsay, here. And I am an online coach. I help people to have results, get results inside of their business and um, get more exposure online using social media and things like that. So I want to do this quick live stream or whatever else because um, I want to share a little bit of my story. And it's going to be a really short version of my story because if you go through my fan page, you can actually see previous videos and I have shared my story before and things like that through videos and things like that. But I want to go over it just a little bit because I don't think people really understand that when you come online to build a business, on, you know, to build a business, that you are going to deal with so many failures along the way before you start getting um, huge results inside of your business. And, um, you know, people like, you know, will, I see people who will join a business or something like that and they don't get any type of results really fast or they're already dealing with some type of hiccups inside of their business. They're already really quick to complain. They're already wanting to, you know, quit, throw in the towel or whatever the case may be. And if you are one of these people, I'm going to tell you right now, you're not going to win in this industry and you really need to consider doing something else. Okay. I know that a lot of us marketers or, you know, you know, entrepreneurs who are online, who are building businesses online, who are, you know, living the lifestyle, who have quit their nine to five jobs, just like I have and things like that. People who are making a lot of money inside of their business. You know, we make it, things look really simple. And the reason why things look really simple for us to do that is because, we have been doing this for years, okay? We have gone through all the, you know, the struggles, the ups and downs, the people who um, who say they're going to join our business, but they don't join our business, dealing with customer service issues, dealing with all types of things like that. And it's, I mean, that laundry list can go on and on forever. And we have gone through all of that stuff, but you know what? The fact that we stuck through it is the reason why we are now on the other side of it where, you know, you can say things like me, like, how I was able to quit my nine to five job back in 2014 and been working full time from home ever since. It's people like, you know, like I have friends who are seven figure earners online and things like that. Okay. The reason why they're able to say that is because they went through all of the struggles, the process, the ups and downs that come along with building a business. And if you are joining a business right now, or you're getting ready, you know, to start like an e-commerce business, or you're joining a network marketing company or whatever else. And if you are already seeing hiccups inside of your business and you're already really quick to complain, again, I'm going to tell you, you need to do something else, okay? What you're dealing with right now is very, very minor, very minor, okay? Um, I even know people, you know, it's like it's people out here who have some real problems, people who have, you know, the real right to complain, but you know what? They go ahead and persevere, they push through it, and they go ahead and get the work done in order to get those results, in order to help the people that's on their team or the people that they're, um, you know, um, uh, they have as clients or whatever the case may be. Okay. So, um, like, you know, I came online in 2013 to actually build a business. That was my first full year of building a, um, um, an online business. And I was doing that part time while I was working a nine to five job, but I have been building like, you know, network marketing companies and things like that for well over like six, seven years. And, you know, and all those companies I failed, okay? And these are like traditional network marketing companies or whatever else that I was a part of that I would get in. They had no type of training um, available. My sponsors went MIA, so I had to kind of figure things out on my own, and I kept going through it. Like, I'll go through a business, I wouldn't get that much success, and then I'll quit. And then I'll join another business, and it would be the same process over and over again. And like I said, in 2013, like I've, I've shared my story before in previous videos, you can check that out on my fan page. But in 2013, I had made a decision that, you know what, I was going to come online, learn how to build a business, but no matter how many times I failed, I was going to go ahead and stay in and just keep going, okay? And the fact that I did that is how I was able to quit my job the following year because I went ahead and stayed in the game. And this is something else that I had also learned. At the end of 2013, I had the opportunity to go to Dubai for a week-long mastermind that was hosted by a venture capitalist who is also a former owner of MySpace, who is now worth over $600 million. And he even said during this mastermind, you're going to have to get used to failure. You're going to go with, you're going to have to deal with so many failures and BS along the way in order to get those bigger results, okay? So people always see, like, you know, um, I mean, talking about him and how he did over $600 million, but people don't understand how many companies that he has failed with in order to, you know, before he even got that result, he started making a lot of money with their business, with his business, okay? And then you, I'm dealing with people, you know, who, you know, join a business, who start like an e-commerce store or who want to start like their own coaching business 
or who um, join like, you know, um, you know, one of my teams, Power Lead System or Motor, um, MCA or whatever else, and the first sign of a hiccup, they're about to lose their shit, okay? <laughs> you know, they want to quit. They want to um, bail out and things like that. And if you already want to do that in the beginning, then you had no intention of trying, no, uh, no intention of building a business anyway. And I'm going to tell you right now that you need to go ahead and do something else. You need to go ahead and stick at a nine to five job or maybe get a part time job. And there's nothing wrong with, you know, a nine to five job or anything like that, guys. Sorry if it's getting a little choppy. There's nothing wrong with having a job or whatever the case may be, okay? But I'm trying to tell you guys that if you are looking for guaranteed money, then you do not need to come online to build a business because you can make money with the online business, but you have to go through the um the learning curve, okay? Just because this is something that you have never done before, just like when you go to a nine to five job, you have to go through that training, um, okay? Like I know I used to work for AT and T and stuff like that. When I used to work for other companies, I had to go through training for at least six to eight weeks to actually learn the business. And then before they put me on the floor, before I had to start making phone calls and things like that as well. You have to expect the same thing when you come online. It's going to be that learning curve. You have to go through training. It's things that you have not done before inside of your business and that you have to learn in order to start getting results out of your business. And if you are coming online thinking that you're going to make money the next day or you're going to complain and bitch and moan that you're not making money the next day or that you have a hiccup, that you have to be on you know, uh, the phone with customer service or the person that you talked to didn't sign up today and things like that. If you are going to be complaining like that already, I'm telling you now, I'm going to tell you again, you need to do something else. Do not come online to actually build a business, okay? You can, and I'm going to say you can be really successful online, but you have to go through the learning process. You have to be active. You have to dedicate at least anywhere from two to four hours each day to you know building your business, going through training, actually implementing the things that you learn and things like that as well. And like I said, it's going to be so many hiccups and things like that because even with, you know, like, you know, like the, the comes like the affiliate companies that I'm a part of, like, you know, Paralee System or MCA and things like that, you know, I provide training for my, uh, my team or the company itself actually provides training as well. Um, and then like, you know, like my coaching, I'm, I'm a little bit more hands on with, you know, with my coaching clients and things like that. And you, um, you know. And there's a lot of other, you know, marketers who do the same. And you have to be grateful for people like that because a lot of us was building traditional network marketing companies in the past where there was no training available. All they told you was, oh, just go talk to your friends and family. And then, you know, that was it. Or, you know, um, like, you know, you'll join a business and then your sponsor could really just go MIA. Like you can't call them. You can't talk to them. You can't do nothing. Okay. Okay. And if you are part of a business right now where you have some type of training um, available and things like that, you should be highly grateful for that because, like I said, a lot of us were building businesses where none of that was available. So I make it a point that whenever I have any type of business that I have training available or I partner with somebody who has some um, really effective training available so that when you join a business that you have the most updated training available that you can go through no, apply that information and get results inside of your business, guys. But it is up to you to go through that training, rewatch that training over and over again, and implement what you learn. Okay, it is nobody's, you know, um, you know, not like fault or whatever else. But you can't solely depend on like your your sponsor. You solely can't depend on other people to help you get results. At the end of the day, you are a business owner. Whenever you or start an e-commerce business, you're joining one of these, um, you know, network marketing companies or whatever the case may be, you are a business owner. This is your business, okay? So when you say things like, you know, well, this is going on inside of my business, I'm going to quit, that hurts you more than it hurts the other person. You're giving up on yourself, okay? So if you really want to build a business, if you really want to be successful online and make the money that you see and all these people are making, then you must understand that you have to go through the process. You have to go through those learning curves. You have to go through all the types of ups and downs that's going to come along with building a business in order to get those results, guys, okay? You're really going to have to dedicate um, the time for that. Set aside anywhere from two to four hours per day to build your business. And really, in all honesty, really give yourself a really good year to build a business, okay? Building a business is not going to happen overnight. And even with some of these businesses that I'm talking about that, you know, I help people out with, you're going to get results or whatever else. But if you want really massive results, 
it, you're going to have to stay in the game for more than a year and keep doing the same things over and over again. It comes down to being consistent inside of your business, and that's where most people also fall off, is that they fail to be consistent, and then also they don't want to take responsibility inside of their business to actually continue their education, to actually implement the things that they learn or whatever the case may be. They're always looking for the next person to blame for the reason why they're not getting that type of result inside of their business, and I don't want that to be you, okay? There's too much information out there for you to um, have success inside of your business or whatever else. And all you need to do is go through that training, implement that training, and be consistent every single day inside of your business. And get over like the little small stuff. It's, I mean, it's going to be so much stuff that you're going to deal with in this roller coaster of building a business, okay? You're going to be on, on the phone with customer service. You're going to deal with people who say they're going to join your business, but they don't join your business that day. You're going to deal with people who you know, buy your product and then want to refund 24 hours later because they didn't get a result. I mean, it's, it's going to be so Okay. It's going to be so many things that you're going to deal with, okay? But if you're not willing to go and deal with that right now, if you're already just coming out the gate complaining about things that's happening to you inside of your business, I'm telling you now that you need to go ahead and just build something else. Just go ahead and just continue working a, you know, continue working a 9 to 5 job or just get a 9 to 5 job. There's nothing wrong with the job or whatever else, but I'm just telling you, if you're looking for more guaranteed money, you can do that at a 9 to 5 job, okay? You can go there, clock in, work for two weeks, and in two weeks you'll get a check, okay? I cannot guarantee you that inside of building a business because it's all depending on what you do and how much effort you're willing to put into it and things like that as well, guys, okay? So like I said, I didn't want to go too much of a tangent on this video, guys, but you have to just be really willing to go through the fire all the ups and downs that's going to come along with building a business and if you do that and if you understand that there's a learning curve and that you go through the learning curve and you go through the process and you implement the training that is provided for you proven training that is provided for you you will get results guys okay so that's what i really wanted to share with you so if you want more information about how to make money online how to build a business online or if you actually have a current com um, business online and you're looking to get more leads, to get more sales, to get more clients, to get more exposure for your business, I want you to go ahead and send me a message and let's chat for a few minutes and see how I can actually help you inside of your business, guys, okay? And again, if you are new to um, network marketing or um, not network marketing, but internet marketing or whatever the case may be, there are results at the end of the tunnel, but you have to just be willing to go through the process, do it every single day and you know, just it's like it's like a few steps. You have to do a few steps every single day, every single day inside of your business, and you will start getting results, guys. Okay. So until the next live stream, peace.